Well, the last few years have been huge for progressive metal, though. It seems like it's it's starting to come into the foreground more than it's ever done before. I guess so. Dream Theater has a lot to do with that, I think. You know, when they came out in the early 90s, I think they uh, spawned a lot of, you know, bands, younger guys who started playing. We were a death metal band at the time, but I was just finding my feet, like going through the record stores, picking up like prog records. And then eventually there was a contemporary band that kind of sounded like those bands, but also had like the heavy edge that I liked. And that was Dream Theater. So they deserve some credit for that. And I remember I got really interested in them because in the first video I saw, the singer had a Napalm Death t-shirt on. I was like, it's meant to be because I love Napalm Death too. Yeah, I'm a... <laughs> <laughs> I'm a massive fan. What can I say? That's awesome, because most people hate us. 